guys, so I'm here with Suzanne, who's the manager at our Opus Downtown location, and we're in the digital printing area. And Suzanne, if you have something printed, what are some other things that you can do with it? Well, one of the things that I've found is reproducing fine art is sometimes it's really nice to actually go back in and add some texture and actually bring the print to life a little bit more. Um, a lot of the times when people are bringing in their fine art images, there's a lot of detail which is inherently in the work, right. which you can see through the detail and the quality of the print, but obviously it's quite flat. So okay. taking the opportunity to go back in with either some paint or potentially some acrylic mediums, and then you're going to get into a completely different beast. Okay. Um, so here's a, a, a copy of one of my paintings, which it's painted in encaustic, so inherently it has a lot of texture to it, which you can see through some of the highlights and shadows. Right. But what I'm going to do is just go in and use some acrylic medium to bring out some of the surface texture, some of those brush strokes, so that it looks a little bit more... And this is printed on the canvas, this not the paper. On the canvas. Okay. <laughs> they get a little sticky, but it's a little yeah. funny. So the acrylic mediums, when they go on, are white. Uh, but dry when clear. they dry, they dry completely clear. So depending on how you want your end result to look, you can actually play up a lot of texture if you wanted to. Right. If you wanted to actually... And you're just painting right directly onto directly it. Directly onto it. You would want to let the print settle for a good 24 hours before you start painting on top of it. Okay. But. After that, it's really very, very stable. And then you can do sort of textures all around, and then if you wanted to actually bring out certain areas more specifically, you could actually leave it thicker and put in some particular paint lines right. relative to what's happening underneath with the image. So once you would have this and say, now, can you get this stretched after it would dry and everything? We, yeah, we sell stretcher bars so okay. that you can stretch it yourself. Um, if you wanted with part of the service, you can actually purchase it stretched and, then and still work back into it after the fact. Right. And then um, what do you have here? I see something that so you've already done. One of the pieces that I uh, have done as well as, originally this is one of the prints on canvas. Um, what we've done is taken that, trimmed it down, so trimmed off all the white, and mounted it on one of our Opus Criddle panels, and then went in with, same thing, with an acrylic gel medium, and just really picked up some of that surface texture, which gives you a whole different feeling. And then what happens is your end result is this is not just a canvas print. All of a sudden, this becomes something which is a piece of fine art in its own right. Perfect.